Hey, this is Emily at Oz Inflatable Kayaks. Now, when we look at max trip length, and I say maximum because some people will say, oh, I'm just going out for an hour or two most times, and then sometimes I want to do a full day. Well, we need a kayak that's going to be okay for the full day. So it's the maximum trip length that you're doing that we would look at. Um, so as trips get longer, certain factors become more important. One is comfort and support. You know, if you're going out for a long day's paddle or a, a multi-day expedition, you need to know that your back is going to be supported, your feet are going to be braced, you know, that you're going to be able to sit in that position for a long stretch without getting uncomfortable. So that becomes more important. Now, fortunately, all of our kayaks are really good at that. <laughs> uh, so I haven't needed to consider that too much in the filtering out. The second thing is speed. So the longer your trip, generally speaking, the faster you want that kayak to go, okay? And you want it to be nice and kind of effortless the, the longer the trip. Um, and then the third one is, is simply practicality. It's more like deck space, um, storage capacity. And this is more when we get into the multi-day expeditions. You know, if you're going out for a few days, you need to be able to load up your deck um, and in, inside the kayak as well with the gear that you're gonna need for that trip. But there is a big caveat to all of these factors, and that is the kayak must first and foremost be fit for purpose. So in this filter here, doesn't matter what you choose, the straight edge kayak will always be there because if you're doing up to class three whitewater, you need the straight edge kayak or the straight edge two kayak. They're the kayaks that are fit for purpose. Doesn't really matter how long your trip is. Same with the attack white water. If you are doing full whitewater, that's the kayak you need, whether you're going out for an hour or for three weeks. And same with the Angler Pro, you know, if your primary purpose of kayaking is to go fishing, you want the best fishing kayak there is, regardless of how long you're going out for. Okay, so if you have any questions about whether a kayak is going to be suitable for the maximum trip length you are doing, please don't hesitate to get in touch. This is Emily at Oz Inflatable Kayaks.